LaptopKey.com, your source for replacement keyboard keys. Notice, many times, laptop manufacturers produce keyboards that look the same on the outside, but have different retainer clips underneath the keys. To help you find the correct repair video for your keyboard, we've created a searchable database. Simply go to LaptopKey.com, enter your laptop brand and model number, scroll down to the bottom of the page and click on View Videos. A list of all compatible videos will appear. Select the retainer clip model that matches your keyboard. That's all, you're now ready to repair your laptop keyboard. For this keyboard, we will be showing the removal and reattachment of the J key for standard size keys, Enter for the wide keys, and F11 for the top row keys. To remove the standard size keys, insert your tool under the middle right edge, gentle pressure up and down, to the top and bottom, until the keycap is removed. To remove the retention clip, support the bottom of the clip with your finger and insert your tool under the upper right corner and push slightly inward and upward at the same time. Push down and the clip will be removed. To reassemble your clips, We'll begin with the top clip, which has a wider edge on top and a small opening in the hole at the bottom. For the bottom clip, there's an opening at the bottom of the square at the bottom. Connect the two halves together, making sure the plastic support arms of the top and the holes of the bottom. Then using metal hooks here, here, and here, we will lay the clip down bottom first, ensuring it hooks on, press at the top, Place our keycap, burn press, and we're fixed. To remove the wider keys, insert your tool under the upper right corner, a gentle upward pressure, and continue down along the edge, along the sides, across the top, to disconnect from the metal support arms, and then more upward pressure on either of the corners disconnect from the clips. To remove the metal support arms, simply lift, push one side out, push up the other, repeat with the remaining arm. Then to remove the retention clips, support the bottom of the clip with your finger and insert a tool under the top edge and apply gentle pressure to either of the corners, pushing inward and upward. downward and the clip is removed. To reassemble your clips, we'll begin with the top clip which has two small holes at the top and then for the bottom clip an opening in the center at the bottom. Connect the two halves together ensuring the plastic support arms of the top and the holes of the bottom. Then using metal hooks here, here, and here we will lay the clip down bottom first ensuring it hooks in the middle, pressing flat at the top, then using holes here and here, we'll replace the metal support arms, putting in one set and the other side, and laying down at the top, repeating for the bottom, lay down flat, and then place our keycap on top of everything, making sure to press firmly around the edges, and the center, and we're fixed. To remove the top row keys, I'm actually gonna turn this sideways. You may find it a little easier to follow along. You'll insert a tool along the top edge, inserting in the middle. Continue at the top and bottom to apply pressure outward until the keycap is removed. To remove the retention clip, support the bottom of the clip with your finger, and insert a tool in the middle of the upper edge and continue upward, applying pressure to the upper right, lower left corners, pressing down, and the clip is removed. We'll return to normal orientation for the next part. To reassemble your clips, we'll begin with the top clip, which has two small holes on the left edge. For the bottom clip, there's a divot coming out on the right side. Connect the two halves together, ensuring the plastic support arms of the top clip 
and at the holes at the bottom. Then, using metal hooks here, here, and here, we'll lay the clip down right side first, ensuring it hooks on. Press flat on the left side. Replace the keycap with a firm press, and we're functional. We'll now show you how to remove a laptop key. Simply pull on the edge of the key in a gentle but firm motion. Lift up and remove the key. It's that simple. If your key is loose and not sticking properly to your keyboard, your retainer clips are likely broken. This issue can be fixed by replacing your retainer clips. Replacement laptop keys and retainer clips can be purchased at LaptopKey.com. LaptopKey.com, your source for replacement keyboard keys.